Okay, here's Jesse. How old are you, Jesse? I'm 11, and this is, and then we're replacing the Toto Universal Hill Valves. And why are we doing that, Jesse? Because the water keeps on. It keeps on going. It doesn't stop filling. Yeah, it keeps right? on going over and over again. So the problem with this is that these totals, um, the filler valve is a different design than the normal kind, right, Jesse? That has a little arm. So you can't just bend it. You actually have to replace it. So now what we're doing is we're going to replace it, right? And you're going to be doing this? Yeah. Okay. So the first step is what? To turn off the water here. Yeah. So. Because I left the water on. Yep. Turn it off. And after that, you have to flush the toilet. Why are you going to flush the toilet? To make sure all water fully drains out. Right. Because we have to change what's in the tank. Yeah. After that, we have to remove the lid. Yes. Let's put the lid on the floor so we don't have an accident with it. We'll put that on the carpet there. Yeah, that's a good idea. When we take off that part, it's gonna leak down, right? What do we need, Jesse? We need in a bucket and then a wrench. Yeah, which we got. And then this fill valve, you could get at Amazon, right? That's where I got yeah. it. So cool. Oh, well. oh, it's made in the USA. All right, Jesse made a good point that if you try to loosen it from up there, it's just gonna drip. So it's best to loosen it from the valve and then from there, go ahead and um, drain it and remove the part, right, Jesse? Yeah. So I'm gonna unscrew it. Yeah. I can get my hands right now. Okay, it's gonna get some water, so get ready to get the water. It's gonna be water, yep. So let drain right here. Who yeah. let drain there? Yeah. That was a good idea, Jesse. And let that drain. So, how are we gonna get the rest? We have to be careful, but the water is going to spill on the floor. On the hose? You got it, right? So it was a little bit messy. Um, what we had to do is just, this toilets are weird where you had to put things. So I ended up putting a cup and I had Jesse pull the top or hold the top until I got the, uh, until we got this uh, nut off thing. Or I don't know what you call yeah, it. Yeah, and it was all messy because. It was messy, huh? So now it's all wet. So at least it's not toilet water, it's, you know, clean water. Look, it comes with the new. So this one has a number, what is the number here? Right there, C, on the side. C. CS, what? 834? Is that 834 or 854? It's 854. 884. 884. 884. You see one, 884? Right there. Okay. That means you have to see number four. CST 884? Yeah, that's it. The height is number four. So it's height four, and what's the refill ratio? No, the, the ratio is number five. Five. Okay, so go here. So we're going to do it to four. You uh, can put all your for higher top, to Top, counterclockwise, unlock, notch settings. Yeah, so you just, oh, look at the P. So look at the P. That's your settings you look at, these things. So right here you have four. So you move it to three, four, right yep. here. So move it up and then lock it. Nope, that's five. Nope, that's three. There you go. I that looks like four, right? Now we see four, right? Yep. Yeah. Four. And then now we gotta put the, the plastic thing in there, see? Now we gotta put the plastic thing right here. It says insert tamper proof accessory. There think, go. Yeah, you know that okay. way it doesn't it doesn't go up and down by accident, right? Yep. It doesn't go up and that down up down accident. Uh, okay, let me hold it. You get underneath and start tightening it. And we can't do this at the angle because the toilet uh, lever is at that same angle. Got it on. Okay. I'm tightening this now. Twist it. Just twist it. You could twist it left and right, or you could twist in a circle. You go ahead and attach it to that piece. The tube. Yep. We're gonna put you put the tubing on that side. Yeah. On the other end already. Have them for it. Well, and then now it doesn't erupt at all. Okay. It's fully tightened right there. Get the other hurt. one too. I'll get the other one too. And then I'll tighten it up for you, okay? Yeah. But then you turn on the water. Let's turn on the water and check it, make sure it's not leaking. Oh, 
Now it's much quieter. Jesse, check if there's leaks on here and at the bottom of the toilet. Do you feel for any water coming out anymore? Uh, I don't feel it now. No water's coming out? Yeah, it stopped filling. Oh yeah, it stopped. But I still hear the water. I think because it's taken a minute to kind of... I think the toilet flapper needs to be replaced. You think it's a bad flapper? Yeah. I think it's a bad... So you think the valve wasn't bad? It was the flapper? I think it was the valve. See? But, but see the flapper's going down? Yeah, but it's not making noise now. But we can change the flapper too. That might be a good idea. Yeah. All right. So flush the toilet, Justin. We'll flush it. Let go of the handle. You gotta make sure it works. Pick it up. Yeah. We gotta see how it fills there. Let's we'll see how that fills. You know why you? I see the, I see the fill line. You don't touch the toilet. So you know why we had to adjust that thing on top? Yeah. It's to adjust the fill line. That on way the it doesn't overfill the line on here. Later, you gotta wash your hands. You know why? Because it's dirty. Yeah, you're touching a toilet. Oh, wow. cool. It's wow. perfect. It's up good. The same. Yeah. You think it's filling up too high, or oh, it's filling up just right, huh? Yeah, it just stopped. And look at all the fill line on the drain part. Okay. It did not drain at that. It did not drain at all.